Hello, and welcome to AIM International's preparatory tutorials for the Information Certification Exam. I'm Steve Weissman, Principal Consultant at Holly Group and a certified AIM training instructor in the realm of content, process, and information management. I'll be your guide as we review the exam's major domains of expertise, and I'll tell you all you need to know to earn that passing grade. Today's subject is mobile applications, a vital part of this special certification which AIM created to support you as you solve your organization's existing information-related problems and plan for its future. For 60 years, AIM has been the leading nonprofit association helping users understand how to best manage documents, content, records, and business processes. This module is part of the Architecture and Systems Knowledge Domain, one of six within the certification program. In it, we'll explore the impact of mobile applications on e-commerce, information architecture, and usability. Mobile applications are exerting a significant influence on virtually every aspect of information management. Nowhere is this more apparent than in the realm of e-commerce, which is feeling the effect in several notable ways. First, there's location awareness. Knowing where a person is by virtue of the GPS capabilities baked into many mobile devices. This means that merchants can push highly localized messages and special offers to customers, or develop campaigns that take local weather conditions, say, into account as for an outerwear retail outlet. Then there's price and satisfaction transparency, covering the ability to conduct instant price comparisons and identify a local store offering a better deal than the one in which the user is standing. This is bringing unprecedented transparency to pricing models and is empowering consumers as never before. The ability to post reviews of products and store experience is doing the same for customer satisfaction. And then there's tap and pay capabilities. Apps are now becoming available to enable consumers to pay for things without having to carry cash or even credit or debit cards. Instead, the mobile device sends encrypted credit or debit card information to the given establishment's electronic payment system or the one embedded in a suitably equipped vending machine. Information architectures also are being forced to accommodate mobile devices and much of this work has to do with developing requirements for connecting to and with a variety of models, operating systems, and user interfaces. One way to minimize the effort is to create an application layer that provides the same data, security, and functionality to the user, whether it's a native mobile or a web app, or in other words, make the user interface dependent on the device and mode of access, but keep the underlying data layer independent. Mobile usability demands that applications, be they native or web apps, take the characteristics of the mobile device into account. Some of these are limitations, like the relatively small size of most smartphone screens, but others represent opportunities for innovation, such as applications that take advantage of the touch screens and gesture navigation these phones and their tablet cousins support so well. Specific considerations include the likes of page length and width, perhaps showing less information per mobile device page, image and text scaling to ensure readability, navigation controls and menus, especially as they relate to position, color, clickability, and so forth, and battery life. This module has explored the impact of mobile applications on e-commerce, information architecture, and usability. Having completed it, you may next wish to have a look at the section on websites and portals. The material you have just reviewed is part of a broader program of study that prepares you to take the Information Certification Exam. This proctored test consists of 100 multiple choice questions and is delivered electronically by Prometric. You'll have two hours to complete it, and upon passing, you'll earn a professional certification that's valid for three years. For more information, please visit www.aim.org certification. Thank you.